Mm, hey guys. So show and tell. I don't think I've ever done an unboxing. I did one on my birthday a few years ago from um, Tammy. What's her channel? Wings of Love Treasures. Wings of Love. And I did the the lot that I bought from Adrian's at. Um, why am I spacing out on names? I can't think of it. Anyway, so this, I'm going to get the hard goods out of the way so I can put them back in the china cabinet in the kitchen. All of these I got from Sandy Spiff. The bird is already up way high above the TV. I can't reach the shelf. Mike put it up there for me. It's so pretty. It's a little, and it's a figurine. It's mixed media. It's a little hummingbird and it's on the top of an avocado tree i recognize what it was yeah just randomly get up and walk away yep 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 all right let's get the big boy out of the way first this is a haul and it's their autumn leaf series but i love it i love it and it's perfect mint absolute mint condition beautiful i have no intent of ever using it but yeah it's a nice one i love this this i don't think it's signed or anything it's just to add some color in my china cabinet so i'm redoing that this is very lightweight though it's felted in the bottom it is finished inside but again i don't think this is anything um extraordinary as far as maker or anything like that but it's beautiful i love the form it's gorgeous. It is felted, which is fine. I mean, I'm not going to do anything with it otherwise, other than admire it. Excuse me, I can't even talk. But I like that. I like the top. It's so light. I did think bone china for I thought, don't be stupid. And it's not bisque. So it is finished. Porcelain. It's pretty. This I adore. I adore all of them. This is glows. You probably won't see it. This thing, it's got, it's got that orange luster look in it. When you're looking at it with the eye that you're not seeing here, it has a glowing effect. Look at that. The finial has it ever been damaged. This looks so good in my lighted china cabinet with the light from above. It just glows. It is so beautiful. I mean, it's beautiful. I don't remember what this is signed, if it is. I mean, obviously, this is pressed or molded glass. This is not blown or anything, but I love this old glass. And last but certainly not least, oh, my gosh, I'm in love with this. Look at that color. Again, I got all of these items, these four, plus other things, but... I'm from Sandy Spiff. S A N D Y S P I F F. Oh, she's um. I don't know if she's going to be on tonight with Stephanie and um, Helen on Stephanie's channel, but Steph and Helen will be on. This is beautiful. This is blown. I just love that. I do wonder if it had a lid. But then again, the double handle doesn't really look good ever had a lid. A lid. There's no flea bites. There's no anything. Yeah, I don't think so. This lip is pretty sharp right there. And it says made in Poland.
<clears throat> Sorry about that. And I was taking my sweet time, too. <laughs> okay, what this is, this is all from Tanya, except for a couple things. Um, the, there's three lots all together. The first two are from, I don't know, a month, a month and a half ago. I just have so much, it's, it takes me a time to get to it. Now, I, I did go through it, but I've slept since then. I haven't seen it since. So some of this stuff will be a surprise to both of us. Now, the box I just got in earlier this week, that one I did go through. But first of all, I'll show you this. This is not from Tanya. This came from um, Patricia at Patsy Craftsy. And it's a signed piece. I just loved it because it's small enough. And plus, I'm trying to get, I know I've said this a million times, trying to get more gold into my wardrobe. <laughs> Don't ask me why. Well, that's why. Because my husband bought me the wedding band, replaced the one I lost. Who is this? Patricia Locke, L-O-C-K-E. Well, it turns out she's a pretty popular, my nose is itching off my face. Um, she's a fairly popular artist. It is really pretty. I had no idea when I bought it from her. I mean, the value is stupid on these. Upwards of $100. I do see color loss here. But that's fine. I don't think anyone noticed. These I purchased. Oh, I cut myself at some point in time. Okay. These I purchased, both of these. Um, This one came in that sterling lot. I love this. The signature is an arrow. There's a couple people that it looks like definitely Native American. So I like both of these. So, I mean, I've got some interest in it, but if I have to keep them, that's okay too, because this one really fits good. This I purchased from Tanya last past Sunday. I love this. Not signed. Looks very Zuni. Could be Navajo, though, because they did a lot. They did everything. So I really like that one, especially this one. I like this one, but it doesn't fit as well as the Snake Eyes. Just when I was going to sell my Zuni stuff. This I really like a lot. It's really pretty on. This is mine. So These to be determined what will be mine. Maybe this. JHC. Who is that? No idea. Anyway, it's a turn lock. Gold is really good. Oh, good. It's inside here. Uh, Mark Graham. Mark Graham. Definitely leather. Hardware's in good shape. This looks small. It's secure. It's secure. Yeah, it's small. Very small. It has grabbed me. It's not moving. You have to put it right in the indention of your wrist. You got to go right in there. Then it's more comfortable. It's kind of cool, actually. Hmm. 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 These look sterling. Don't they? These are clip-ons. These are cool. These are cool. Oh, man, they got one of those stupid pad things on. It's my hair. It keeps touching. Oh, I was going to cut it yesterday and didn't do it. And then a friend told me at dinner, oh, I like your hair. And I'm thinking, I'm just getting ready to chop it off. I think I will. Yeah, it's got one of these sticky things. They're not usually signed there anyway. Don't know. No missing stones. These are really pretty. I like these. I like clip ones. Yeah, it doesn't look so silver now on the camera. Let's see if this one has all its stones. Nope, it's missing two. My hands are too shaky and I'm too damn blind to do this stuff anymore, so that's not going to happen. They're going to end up going as is. They're nice. I'll still test them for sterling just to see. I don't think they are. Got a little bracelet. With a cute little rhinestone, Dabradu, and something else. Oh, a swallow. Uh, 
Swara, it is Goba, and this is The Journey Begins, Jewel Cade, J-E-W-E-L-K-A-D-E, -E -E, Jewel Cade, no clue about Jewel Cade, is a Will Birdie marked, no, nah. is the bracelet marked anywhere else, nope, 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 nope. It doesn't look that big. Where's my cone? Where's my cone, man? Man. Come on. Oh, well, good grief, Charlie Brown. Huh. Probably like a seven. Oh, you could put it anywhere you want, I think. Yeah, because it's a lobster claw. And all these links here. So, okay. multi size. This looks very Monet, doesn't it? <laughs> yes, it does. It looks very Monet. Yep. Nope. I thought it was a sister. Oh, it is a sister claw. Yep, it's got to be Monet, especially with the sister claw. Look at the gold tone on that, though. It's like, almost looks gold tone, but yeah, it's the sister claw. I know my camera focus sucks, but life goes on. I'll double check. I don't think anybody else used that, though. In costume. Of course it's the wrong side. Of course it is. Yeah, it's a Monet. Mm. I don't know. It's probably like a good 22 inches. That's pretty. It's really pretty. What earrings do I have? Yeah, I got on Spiny Oyster. The reds don't match. Oh, but it's pulled my hair in it out. <laughs> Getting busy around that ear. It has a wire. I have to... So it's not sticking out. I give. Man, my nose is itching off my face. What are nice earrings in here. These are Tiger's Eye in gold tone. Pretty, pretty. These look like kind of plain. Ah, oh, they're Joan Rivers. I was going to say, they're quality. I knew that. Joan Rivers. Those are nice. Clipbacks. Clean as a whistle, too. Thank you. Thank you, Tanya. Takes me a long time to finally get this stuff, huh? These are copper. I think it's like a sunburst on there. Uh, these don't look like they'll be signed. Oh, they say PC. Definitely a signature because it's very intentional. Yeah, making sure what in the G. Yeah, PC. No clue. Little copper button earrings. Yeah, that is like a starburst kind of thing going on. Maybe I have enough sun from outside. I don't need this light. Oof. Eh, so so, huh? So so. Anyway, those are cute. Oh, I tossed this in here. I loved this bracelet and I kept it and I thought I had other pieces to it. I've had this thing. Oh my gosh. Probably. six years i was going to fix it it's really not a bad fix either i don't know what my problem is look how pretty that is i need the light it's old very 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 old those bead caps the glass that's in there i need to test them for gemstones okay the clasp is here it's a lobster claw so it's not as old as i thought this is actually an easy fix. I'm just goofy. <laughs> okay. Oh, these are pretty. Uh, these are really pretty mosaics. They look like they might be sterling. 
they're close to micro. My, I would call them micro mosaic. They're small enough. They're not marked, which is pretty normal. They're like they're probably silver plate or something like that. Probably some silver content in those. At least it's different from most of the tourist pieces that you see. What is on my finger? Oh, my brain. <laughs> I keep not want. I got one of those silicone things on it. Oh. That really is pretty, huh? It's really nicely done. Really pretty. I don't know if I need to clean this or that. I cleaned that recently. So I don't know. I don't know. We'll wipe it off. What do you mean? We'll wipe it off. Let's see if that helps because it seemed pretty grody. It's grody, man. Okay, we'll see if that helps. So while we're talking jewelry, these I got from Misty, Misty's Treasure Chest. It's got a big old name on it. Uh, Frank and Hilda Corey, C-O-R-I-Z. Then it says S, D is in, S is in Sammy, D is in David, P is in Paul Sterling. So S, D, P, Sterling. Aren't these cool? It's a turquoise and spiny oyster. Gorgeous. Eclipse. I was going to say it's the most ever paid for earrings, so it's not. I think it's in second or third place. <laughs> this isn't marked either, but probably another one of those. Italy travel pieces. Really nice micro um, mosaic in this one. There's some little tiny, tiny pieces in there. That is really well done. That is really pretty. Really pretty. Let's see if this looks better now, shall we? Yeah, much better. That's a really pretty one. Sorry about the shakiness. That's really pretty. And they're the same. They the same, man. Probably turquoise glass. Might even be a hard acrylic. And they are signed. Vogue, J L R Y, probably for drawer, right? Vogue, like the magazine. They are cute on those timeless pairs you can wear when you're eight or eighty. <laughs> really pretty. I like this. Um, it's not wire. I thought. Well, let me double check. I'm not fibbing. It might be individual wires. It is. It's wrapped like a nest. Pretty cool. So those are actually individual wires. So it's kind of like a bird's nest. It's a bluebird's nest. It's a bluebird. See? See? I think those are pretty cool. Those are pretty cool. I like those. I've never seen Vogue jewelry. I can't say I'm surprised, but I've never actually laid my hands on a pair. These are pretty. See, I need the light to see. It overwhelms the jewelry. The jewelry. Is that just a smooge? Yep, just a smooge. So this is what? The third pair? One, two... I thought there was a third of the micro mosaic. No. This is the third pair. Really pretty. Cute, cute. 
Very cute. Looks like Mother of Pearl in the middle, doesn't it? No, it's not. Those are interesting. Neat. Very neat. Okay. Ooh, screwbacks. Ooh, this is scarabs. These are probably gold filled or something. AMA, AMA, and then, yep, 120th 12 karat gold filled. Is that what that says? Anna? No, Amore? Amco. <laughs> hey, it's tiny. Amco. Okay. Amco. AMCO? No, that's the transmission people. A double M C O, right? I don't watch TV in years. It still sticks with you, right? There's old jingles and stuff. Is that a scare? What the hell is that on there? Yeah, it is. That's his, yeah, his head and his body. Okay. Is it carnelian or is it glass? It's carnelian. Cool. These are nice. Gold filled carnelian. Straight up screw bags. Cute, cute. Cute, cute. And that little box is empty. These are cool. I don't think they're bake light, but they're cool. Or if these glow. Classic, right? Woo! The day the earth stood still. Uh, yeah, I really need to find you. Control this light. Okay. Nope, we have no glowage. It actually looks peach colored. Pretty though, but no, there's no glowing going on. It was worth the shot. These are groovy. I like those. Okay, it's just like a J. Crew or Kate. It doesn't have the weight for Kate Spade, but who knows? Thought I saw a signature. I thought I saw a putty cat. There's something, or not? <laughs> it's like now. It's oh, this time I'm sure there's something there. Uh. Abbey dog on it's a tri it's a crown trifari. Okay, very cool. Very cool, very cool. I don't want the enamel to get scratched. Of course it came in a bundle. It survived that. This is mine. I must have thrown stuff in this box willy nilly. Oh, I was wearing this and tossed it. Okay. I'm a bad kid. How in heaven's name? Oh there you go. Yes, it's mine. The K KJL satin gold. Isn't that gorgeous? Isn't that gorgeous? What are we wearing, Roxy? Oh, we switched to silver and black. Right today. Okay. I need to put Mother Neck up there. I need to redo this whole area. I did get one picture that I bought. I feel bad over her name because she was. On with I don't I don't remember I feel bad I'll find it and add it so this is other hard goods isn't as beautiful the butterflies I love the gold frame love the frame and it says on the back oh I'm gonna murder this um. See, I don't know if that's a T or an L on the front. Either at least, I don't know. I don't. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna butcher that. But it tells you what it is. Dio Club. <laughs> Forget. And the stamp at the bottom: the rare butterfly and butterflies and insects. 
Oh, it's a phone number, 211-439-0326. Cool. But I love it. It's so pretty. But I think I'm going to do what I had done before and just, like, fill this up. Because I've got some nice lithographs and some small needlepoint and stuff like that. I can, they all have the gold frames. Ooh, this looks like vermeil or gold over maybe it made gold filled something. This is gorgeous. Very lightweight. Really pretty glass in there. Who made you? Oh, grief. You can't see. So shiny. Okay, it's got a scale. Like the scales of justice. And... Uh, one... Uh, one 20th... 10 carat. I'm surprised it's not filled on sterling. Okay. Nice. That glass is really pretty too. It's a nice big stone in there. That's pretty, 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 pretty. Very pretty. I love that. It's another brooch. Oh, I love the form on this, the leaves where they're made like bubbles. <laughs> I feel like I've seen this somewhere before. That's all gold tone. It's just really shiny in the middle. It's not yellow or anything. It's all gold tone. Yikes, it's going to stab me. Oh, it is signed. Let me get this closed first before I truly do stab myself. I already got a cut on my top of my wrist. I don't know where in the world it came from. I wasn't doing anything rowdy. Rowdy. Oh, it's a Giovanni. It's a Giovanni. I like that form. Pretty cool. All right. Ooh, pretty earrings. Look at these chunk. Oh, these are so popular right now. Look at these chunk amonkas. That is so cool. Very optical, right? <laughs> Oops. Yeah, that's just going to bling so much. We're not going to be able to see that very good on the camera. Be surprised if these aren't signed, but they just they feel nice. So if they're not, they're still high quality. You can tell when you hold them, when you feel them. Yep, not signed, but definitely good ones. Oh wait, what do you say, Kenneth Lane? Okay, yep, definitely quality. These are nice. I like KJL. I like Kenneth Lane stuff. I all his prettiness. I have seen this before. It's Japan. I don't know. Yeah, they're glass. This is Japan on the back. Pretty, pretty cut glass, a facet cut, and it's um, prong set. I've seen this before. Ooh, this looks like Bakelite. Nondescript chain. Chain could have come from anywhere, anytime. But it's got one of those... Um, I don't know what color this will be when it's cleaned, if I clean it. This metal, who knows. Here's what's important. That's not wood. So I'm thinking that might be Bakelite. It could be. Definitely could be. I've got a whole big bag of buttons I've never tested. I was tempted just to sell them. I've already separated them and everything. The ones I want to test. 
Well, this is a cute little charm bracelet. Why are the clasp always weird on these things? It's like there's a charm right on top of where it's closed. What are you doing? Get out of there. Yeah, I think I'd close it above that dude. So what we got? We got a queen inside a heart. Queen of hearts, I suppose. We got the frog. Oh, it's looking like fairy tales. A frog on a lily pad. This is some weird looking bird. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you. This is a question mark. It says, guess who loves you? And this part moves. Ooh. What are you? I think I already did that one. Yep. What do we got in here? Oh, look. Very cool. Oh, it's the mustard seed. It's the mustard seed. And this says, you're a cutie. You're a kitty, kitty patootie. And this is the genie with the glass ball, I suppose. Crystal ball. Crystal ball. And it's a pretty heart. It says, you are always in my heart. And it's got all those sea pearls inside the heart. Anybody claim this little booger? There's something at the bottom. I hope it's supposed to be H O E C O Home Homeco H O M C O because it's a capital H, okay, a big H, and then it's the O M. Is it C O? <laughs> yeah, and it's the O M C O, like in the center, with the O M above the crossbar, and the <laughs> C O below it. So it's a weird mark. I'm gonna assume it's home co. Oh, did we miss the dog? He's cute. He's missing an eye. He's missing an eyeball. It's too bright, little dude. Too bright. See, his one good eye is shining. <laughs> his one good eye. That's cool, though, huh? The fold over class. The home co claim the class, too. No. All right. So you can hook it wherever you want. Oh, no, that's not true. It's a fold over. This is where the ring's at, sitting right on top of the dog. You can move it, I think. Let me see. Let's see if it's soldered. I mean, not that you couldn't cut it. You could cut it. It looks like it is soldered, but almost, I mean, because it's like black there, like crusty looking. Let's see if crusty crust comes off. What's going on here? Is that the gold tone loss from it being clasped? That's a possibility. I guess. No, it really looks like a solder to me. It really does. It's just not gold tone. Okay, so not crazy about the closure situation, but these are cute charms. Be easy enough to move this, although yeah, I see why it's soldered. That's a lot of weight. I guess you learn to deal with it, right? Or maybe you could just hook it someplace else. Very cool. I know it took forever on that. Ooh, pretty, 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 prettiness. Oh, I love this. Look at that bracelet. Wow, I don't think you're orange enough. I just took my crystals down. They're not even close. 
Not even close, madam. That's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Of course, those are all prong set. I don't see any marks on this. Oh, it's got little stones on the top of the photo of class. It's nicely finished. That's a good thing. Looks pretty big. The back is clean. Looks nice. Looks kind of big. I can't believe my cone's not like right here. It's normally like right under my butt. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy fingers. I don't know. Seven and a half easy, not bigger. Very 70s. And it's got a little finished end. A hook. A size of a texture. Just texture. Oh, it's on point right now. It's gold is in. And with summer quickly approaching, it's interesting. Could be start. That was stretch, but it's not. Hmm. Spring ring. Looks silver. These little pearls. Yeah. Has a hang tag. What say you, sir? What say you? By steel. Avon 925. Interesting. Interesting. Another one that's probably seven and a half. Ooh. Glam, glam. Glam, glam, glam. Ooh, that's like a watermelon. Check these earrings out. These are amazing. These are crazy. Now, these are serious earrings. I don't think they're that old. I mean, they, they're technically vintage, yes. Yes. These are huge. They're really pretty. And they're not that heavy. Those are nice. I need some backs. Oh, this is pretty. A, B, and black or dark blue. Black. Very nice prong setting. Um, probably 50s, 50s, 60s. Oh, they are signed. What do you say? Karu, K A R U. Capu Arc, A R K. K E K A oh wait K four it's either K A R U or K four R U it must be K A P U and then A R K E Inc. No idea, none, but beautiful, really nice. You know what I bought? This is two lots, actually, what I'm showing. these. This is two lots together. Um, when she was doing that, well, it was late night to me. I don't know what time it was for her. Um, sale to raise money for her neighbor whose electricity was turned off. The lady's daughter had passed, and I don't know. I forget the whole story, but she did it. She got enough 
This paid for both boxes. Thank God. Um, oh, these are nice. These are Savorsky. You know that without even looking for a mark. These are extremely nice. Beautiful. Good size Savorskis. Nice. Nice. I know who wants those. How cool. It's a sterling silver little snowman spring ring. Little pendant. Cute. I think there was earrings that went with that. I might have put them with the Christmas stuff already. I better, I better check all this paper. Okay. We're good. We're good. Put these back in the box that came with all the earrings so that I know what's what. Oh. All right, got a few more things. I don't think it's just sterling. It's probably nickel silver with, I mean, gas turquoise chips. I don't think it had a signature or anything. It might be silver, but I don't know. Maybe it's just old, and that's why it's got that color. Don't know. It's bigger than a 7. These are so pretty, and they're so vintage. Look at these backs. They're like a sword handle, you know what I'm talking about? Please don't lose your back. Chicky poo. Are these the ones that have to screw on? Yes, these screw on. These backs are cool. You'll see what I'm talking about. Like a sword handle. Look at these adorable earrings. Aren't those pretty? I bet these are loose sight. Yeah. But I don't know. I think I'm just seeing the white back coming through. Yeah, no, it's just clear. I was seeing that white back shining back to me. Regardless, they are sweet. Oh, you know, that color of gold looks gold. And the fact that they screw off. No, and this back is glued on, so yeah, no. No, no, no. Highly doubtful. No, now that I see the color up close, no. But at a glance, at a glance, that gold didn't look bad. Especially when you got gold posts, you know. Makes you think. Makes you think. Maybe. Maybe, baby. And some cute little earrings. Pearl and stone. Pretty, pretty. And these look like garnet. Pretty little earrings. Mm, those posts look nice. Hooks, I should say. Oh, no mark on those, but they really do look like the gold or gold film. There's our little snowman necklace. These are really pretty. Uh, probably amethyst, maybe garnet. I think amethyst. These are probably gold over silver, but really pretty. Really, really pretty. They clock really well. What say you? Anything? 
They look nice though. The stones, the color of them. These are bead set. Actually, there's no clear stones there. That's just all like silver tone bead work or silver bead work. All right, these say 925 China. Is there an R or something? These really look like, or, you know, like, yeah, Ross Simons. So it's gold over silver and probably amethyst. Cute little babies. Sweet. This was the find in the whole thing. This paid for both the boxes, both the lots. This is a signer. Oh, this is a signer tank tracks. Look at the, the gold tone on this for the age. This is unbelievably nice. So locking class. This is nice. They were um, on the high end. I saw 400 on these. So there's a few out there. Yep, sign on the back here, sign on C I N E R. Works good. Works good. Wrap that back up. That definitely was the find of that of those two. Is there some more to that group? Yeah, there's some more to because they were two lots. Maybe they are separate. I don't know. I just went through them really quick. Like, I don't know, a month ago or something. I mean they've just been sitting aside. Make sure I got the right boxes okay i do no this is the one i just got all right this is the second lot from when i bought them when she was paying her neighbors electric this is unikite on cord really pretty unikite and it's got um little amethyst beads here Pretty. Oh. Oh, these are nice. Really nice. Oh, look at that. Gorgeous. AB crystals. Uh, that's just texture. It's not a signature. Unsigned. But beautiful. Where's your mate, mate? There it is. These are nice. And they're going to climb your ear, too. Of course, they're clip-ons. These are going to climb nicely. These are pretty. These are really pretty. Really pretty. Another bracelet. This one has a B. It says Queen above the B. It says Queen. So Queen B. Who is Queen B? JK. So this is a. No, it's not KJL. JK. And then a little Jester's crown on the other side. So it's got your Jester's crown. Or hat, and then just the J, K. Not a clue. Oh wait, here we go. Jewel cage. The other thing we had was a jewel cage. Another bracelet. Jewel cage. And lobster claw, and you can probably hook it anywhere in here. Let's see. Yeah, real easily. All right. So that fits a lot of people. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. I don't remember this. Yeah, I didn't give this much attention. It's obvious. This feels like plastic. Might be. It's pretty bad when you can't tell, isn't it? Other glass. 
Okay, cool. Let me check all of them. Yep. Oh, didn't I have a different color? A uh, uh, red and clear. Really pretty. Lobster claw. So you got red and clear stones. Three strands. Very pretty. Very pretty. Nice. Instant layering. You could go one more with this too. I wonder if this chain over here matches it. No, because this is that fat, like 3D chain. But, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it is Friday. Here's to the freaking weekend. Drink to that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, let the game is unsinking. As I tell you. Ooh. Look sterling. Alright, this is cool. Look how see through. It's totally see through. Very cool. I guess a shell. Looks sterling. Looks blackened. Just a cool little funky piece. And nope. Lobster claw. Light, light, light. Doesn't weigh a thing. Forgot I had these on. These go in the other lot. I want to keep them together so I can keep track of cost. Making sure I got lots of stupid, but not stupid. I got lots of boxes under the table. Ooh, this is very pretty. Enamel butterfly. I like the gold tone on this. This is beautiful. It's a crown trafari. That is gorgeous. I love those colors. Very nice. The form on this is great. And that gold tone. And look at the back. Yeah. Yeah. That's really nice. Very, very nice. Oh, I keep that enamel in good condition. These look sterling. Very old. Screw back. Little leaves. Is that sterling? Cute, huh? Yeah. Cute, cute. Okay. And that's that. And then, and then, I've got the lot that I just bid on and won this past Sunday. Okay. I think I have the signed stuff on top here. This isn't signed, it's put on top because my niece is here and I meant for her to, to see it. Because she has one um, of mine that she wears a lot. I swear these feel like pearls. They're not tied or anything, though. But they really do look like pearls. Really pretty. I don't know. I don't know. I think these are all sterling. These are electroform, so they're hollow. They need clean desperately. Cute. More earrings. These are very lightweight. Probably Mexico, if anything. These are not the original bags. If they don't say Mexico, I'd be surprised. These are pretty. Oh, these look nice. The simplicity of them looks nice. 
back the little wires a little wonky, but can always fix ear wires. There we go. Uh, surprise, these aren't signed. Nope. Very lightweight, but very pretty. Stylistically, just really nice. Just, I like the form. I like those. Surprise, they weren't signed. Oh, these are cool. Wow. These are turquoise. Look to be sterling. I don't see any mark. It doesn't matter. Check these out. These are like 1940s. Nice. Turquoise screwbacks. These are cool. I have to like pull them open to get them on my ears or so fat. Please do it this way. I'm seeing if I could cheat and modify them the, the fast and easy way. <laughs> Just hook something to the back, but no. They're going to be too heavy. These are nice. There's some age on these suckers. Definitely. Ooh, prettiness. These look Native American, too. I thought they were marked, but it's not. It's just the texture. These are also screwbacks. These look gold filled. Or gold over, maybe. Either way, they're nice screwback earrings. They do look like this. That design to me looks does they look Native American to me. Might not be. I don't know. These are cute, kind of different. 